Hey guys, it's Elonic here, back with another video. Um, it's not an unboxing or review, it's just something that I made up with pure Legos. And uh, you're probably wondering why I'm using my old Battle Striker Stadium, but it's the only one I've tested it out in. And I really want to show you before I don't have enough time. And so what I made is a Lego Beyblade. It's kind of ugly right now, I know, but it's a prototype. It actually really spins. Um, I'm not going to do an actual battle with a real Beyblade. With a metal generation Beyblade. Because it just break apart. But if I make another Lego. Or if I'm lucky enough to go on eBay and get a plastic gen. Uh, I'll probably do a battle with that. And so it actually launches with a normal Beyblade launcher. So you don't have to make up your own. I'll pro maybe be doing a tutorial of this soon. Uh, I really don't know. It took me forever. And it's, um, I haven't come up with this name yet. I think I might just name it, uh, Took Forever. That's what it took forever. I think that's what I might, I might name it. And the only for it to work is you're going to have to make the launcher even. See right now, right there, right now, it's bumped, kind of going up. And you've got, you can't do that. That is perfect. So I'll do show you real quick. Three, two, one, let it It's not perfect as I need to make fix it a little. But you know, it took forever to make it. And it's really big. And uh, it also works with the wind and shoot launcher. Um if I can find it. But I don't really know where the wind and shoot launcher is. Even though I just had it. But I don't know where it is. But it also works with that, but it just does not work with the string launcher. It, this, it doesn't work with the string launcher because of this. This little bump. Where that's. Where there's no screw, there's a screw, or there's a screw. It's because of the bump that it won't work. Because it's, it just, see it hits the studs, which makes it, I'll, I'll just show you real quick. Well, that's bad. Watch. See, it, it won't, it won't turn. And it just makes it jam. It'll probably break the string launcher, but maybe I'll be fixing that soon. I don't know. That's all I've gotten so, to, so far. It took me about a, two days to make this. Um, but I didn't work at full force, so it probably took me about four, uh, four or five hours to complete it and make it to where it actually spins. And, yeah. Cool. So, if you like it, please tell me, and if you can, if you have any ideas of how I can fix it, please tell me. Um, tutorial may be up soon. Uh, I don't. I didn't use any weird parts for it. It was all stuff that you can get out of a normal pack, except for this little circ this circular piece. I don't. I don't really remember where you can get that, but you can get that out of Lego sets. I'm sure of it. And I still have to put some decorations on. I already put in its bit beast, but I still need to fix it. Its bit beast is. One second. I need to fix it. Just a piece broke off. But, um, it's Bit Beast is that little white thing in there. I just put that in there. I don't know what it is yet. But I might call it Took Forever, Took, and then as the metal as the wheel, and Forever as the energy ring. And not energy ring, but you know, whatever. Or, but I might actually call it, um, Metal Destructor, maybe. I haven't made up a name for it yet because I just made it to where it worked. And I'm going to try it just one more time because I really like this thing. It's really big so I need a bigger stadium. And I think it's actually a bit more of a attack type in a way. It's kind of like, a, like an attack and defense type mixed together. Its tip is an attack. Its square wheel is a defense. Its spin track is a balance type. 
I'm totally making this up as I go. And this part was just to help to where the real normal Beyblade launcher would fit. But, uh, it kind of looks like Optimus Prime's head. There's the face, the eyes, the side pieces. And so, yeah, it's been a little look. And one last time.